adults should do when we're, when we're working on the upper respiratory system is to open up the thoracic inlet. And it looks like this, and it's a myofascial technique. So we're looking for three different, usually three different planes of range of motion. Anterior, posterior, medial, lateral, and rotatory, counterclockwise, clockwise. And then you can choose to take the tissue gently uh, where it wants to go towards the restriction you find and you stack them like pancakes. I use the analogy IHOP um, to remember to stack each techniques one on top of another. So if she was rotated left, anterior, and lateral, if you want to go against the grain, we call that direct, and then she would take a deep breath in and relax and just breathing techniques are just a distraction and you would take it oh, into a new barrier, establish a new barrier, or you could do it indirectly and go with what you just found, stack each on top of another and do that. This is opening up the thoracic inlet. The concept is, is that you have a tremendous amount of neurovasculature uh, in this region that needs to be cleared, especially when someone has an upper respiratory infection or anything up in this general area, you want to start clearing this out and moving the, moving the fluids in the lymphatic system towards the thoracic duct.